Now, now it's time for Jared and Katie's War of the Roses call on 107.5 KZL, the number one hit music station. Hello, guys. Big time AML here, and I wish I was emailing you under different circumstances. My daughter Sarah just got engaged last weekend, and I cannot stand her boyfriend slash fiance, Chad. Oh, no. I don't trust him, and I think he's just trying to marry into the family because we are wealthy. Well. I know that might sound bad, but I've been there for my daughter on the several times he's cheated on her when they first started dating. Come on. It's not sounding good. It's not good. I want to see if he's up to his old tricks or with his new tricks. Can you guys do a War of the Roses on him? Thank you, Lorraine the mother. And we do have Lorraine on the phone. Good morning, Lorraine. Good morning, guys. How are you? Good, Good morning. morning. I, you know, I wish you were emailing under different circumstances or we're yeah. talking under different circumstances. So how long yeah. has it been? I, I don't know if you know, but how long has it been since your daughter came to you about him cheating? The first time. The first time. Oh, my gosh. I mean, that was probably seven years ago. They've been together a while now. Okay. Oh, wow. All right. Unfortunately. And do you feel like he's changed his ways at all? or do you no, just No, no, you- no. And I don't know why she's buying into it. It's ridiculous. I'm sh- I'm sure he's hasn't changed one lick, and I've I mean I've almost given up over the years trying to talk her out of it. But now that they're engaged, this can't happen. I'm willing to bet cannot he, happen. I'm willing to bet he didn't ask for anybody's permission before he proposed. Oh, of course not. Yeah. Oh. Okay. And you he's say and you, he doesn't have manners or anything. He's oh. absolute trash. Oh. Wow. Okay. This is not uh, a good start. Tell us how you feel. Well, I, I understand if, if you've already known he's cheated on your daughter a couple of times, it would make you angry. Yeah. Um, oh, and, yeah. And what, what makes you think he's after your money? Well, I, I mean, we just, we are very wealthy and I mean, he's just trash. I mean, what else would he, I, I, I just, I don't want, it's nothing against Sarah. She's gorgeous and smart and he's not, he's, I don't know what the appeal is, but I'm sure he's after the money. He's just that kind of person. He's always talking about, you know, always trying to get her to come to me and say, hey, well, maybe your mom could help us I know, see. repair the car or buy a new car. Or I see. I- I'm sure as soon as they're married, which I'm never going to let happen over my dead body, that's going to be the first thing he starts to do is start looking for money. Do you okay. think, at, I mean, is there any part of you that really believes she's truly in love with him? No, I think that, uh, I don't know. I, there was a guy that she dated before him who just was absolutely perfect. And I don't know what happened. And uh, she was just devastated by that breakup. And then the next thing I know, in comes this piece of trash. And she's, you know, all over the moon. And I, I just think he got a girl while she was down. And I haven't been able to convince her that this is not the guy for her. For seven whole years. Right. Okay. Right. Oh, I've been trying. Trust me. You're just looking out for her best interest. Okay, well, right, hold on. we're going to make yeah. the call, and um, you can jump in You know, at any time. We'll find out if he's cheating or not, okay? Okay, okay. All right, hold on one second. We're going to make the call. Hello? Yes, is this Chad? Uh, y- yes, who's calling, please? Hi, Chad. This is Rick from. How are you? Oh, uh, I- I'm I'm okay. How's, how's well, it going? I'm well, sorry. we're gonna make your who's day calling? even. We're gonna cha- change your mood from okay to great. We are doing a promotion. We're giving away a romantic giveaway for two to Orlando, Florida, and we drew your name at random to call you and offer you that free trip. <laughs> are you serious? I'm dead serious. You know, it's a part of our, our company. We want to get word of mouth. Um, there's no obligation to, to anything. We just hope you tell your friends that you enjoyed the trip once you go. But just a way of us, uh, you know, spreading the word and, and kind of giving back to the community. Oh, hell yeah. That's, oh, that's, that's great, man. That's awesome. Now, you can, yeah, take, that's great. you can take the trip anytime in the next 12 months. All we need, though, is for our records and for our purposes is we have your first and last name already. We just need the first and last name of the person that you would like to take with you. Yeah, that, oh no, that's that's fantastic. Um, okay, yeah, I'll, I'll do. Uh, uh, the name's uh, Jamie. L- Jamie. L- J- Jamie. L- oh my God! What did I tell you? I knew it. You are a piece of garbage. I did. This? Did I tell you? Tell them who Lorraine? you're engaged to, Chad. You piece of. Oh man. Uh, what are you doing? Is this, is this real? Is this, is this a joke? You're, you're such a piece of trash. They're, you're not marrying my daughter. There's no way. Who's Jamie? 
Another don't one of the girls you're cheated who, who on I her am, with? Who I'm not going to marry, okay? I don't care. What are you going away on a romantic getaway with her for? Well, it's none of your business. Why don't you stay out of it, all it, right? It's my business. It's if my any daughter. Any problem I have with Sarah is because of you. You know, all her fights are because of you. Oh, my God. You are such garbage. Where do you come up with this? You're garbage. Absolute who does this? Trash. Who, who absolute, absolute in, trash. You get a chance to go this? away on a romantic crazy. getaway. You're engaged to my daughter, and you're taking some Jamie girl? Why don't you why don't you just mind your own business, okay? Showed your true colors, buddy. I swear you have shown your true colors. Did I tell you, you he was anything. garbage? I told you're you. So I knew you were there. cheating. You're, you're you so... never stop, even though you keep telling her that you're never gonna do it again. Why do you keep doing this? What is your problem? Why are you why are you like you're so crazily involved in, in her life and in my life it's that it's my it's, daughter. It's I'm sorry too much. if your parents don't care about you and haven't raised you properly. This is my daughter. And I am here to protect her against like you. Well, I'm the one who needs protection against like you because you're you know what? too much then in why business don't you just step away, break the engagement, she'll get over it real fast, and everything will be fine. Anything. How does that sound? I love it. Uh uh-uh. uh. Uh uh-uh, uh, I'm not breaking the engagement. Oh, uh, well, and you're not going to say anything about her, her about this. And you do. When, I tell, when she hears what you just did, how are you going to explain this to her? What do you mean when she hears it? She's not going to hear it. Oh, she's going to hear it. Trust me. She's oh, going to hear gonna it. Tell Who's her? Jamie, by the way? That name is awfully familiar. That's that's a thought. Well, I, uh, that, that, that's her friend. How do you not know who that? How do you know everything about her and not know who her friend is? I know who her friend is. I'm so livid at you that I'm having trouble even thinking. I'm spitting angry. That's well, the girl she went to college of, with, isn't it? So what are you doing going away with her? Why don't you focus on your own life, okay? Dude, you're, you are, you're done, okay, buddy? Just swallow that fact. You are done. Hey, Chad, uh, we're going to jump in here. The, this is Jared and Katie and Jason from Jared and Katie in the Morning on 107.5 KZL. Hi. Unbelievable. And, yeah, when you ask how she's going to hear it, she might be hearing it right now. 107.5 KZL on the radio. Hello. Uh, ha ha. So what's the deal, man? Nothing, man. Nothing. Well, it's got to be something. Is there, is there no trip? Is that not a real thing? No, there's no, no trip. There's no That's trip. what you're worried about? Yeah. The trip? What about all right, the... All right. I, I didn't know. I didn't know, if there, I didn't know what it was. There's got to be something going on. Why are you taking your friend? Just because, you know... I don't know. That's no. why I'm asking you. It sounds like a good trip, you know? Well, why wouldn't I'm you like, take your fiancé? Because she's busy? I don't know. But, okay, okay now you don't know. know. This would be like a good vacation from each other, you know? No. 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 Not when you're engaged. Uh-uh. No, you, that, that's, that doesn't happen. That doesn't exist. It's, like, it's a soft engagement. It's not like a hard engagement. A soft <laughs> engagement. I've heard it all. It's a soft engagement. <laughs> I've heard it all now. Oh, oh no. Like a soft opening, and then you have the grand opening? It makes what? no sense. So you, it's, you know, it's, it's more casual. Lorraine's crazy. Lorraine is... She doesn't sound crazy to me. She, she sounds, sounds like, like a, a mother. Mom. Yeah. Does your mom, like, make me... You call her three times a day and, like, like track your every single move? Like, that's crazy. Well, no, obviously but... she should because look at what you're doing. Yeah, she knows what's up. Yeah, well, it's that thing that, like, when you assume someone's guilty, then they're going to act more guilty, you know? I think no, no. dude. I didn't think Look. you were guilty. I didn't know if you were guilty, but you're oh, acting guilty. Oh, whatever, now. man. I don't need to be judged. This is Chris is so stupid. You don't, you guys don't know me. Well, yeah, we don't know you, but all we know about you is it doesn't sound good. Uh uh-uh. uh. Is there no trip? Is the trip real or is this? <laughs> no, there's no. No, trip. there's oh, no my. trip. Third What's time. wrong with you? What about your? You know what? Then f- you guys. This is bullshit. I'm out of here. Okay. You can't even make this stuff up. That is. He's the worst. Did he hang up. Yeah, I tell you. If you would like Jared and Katie to do one of their War of the Roses calls for you, simply email katie at 1075kzl.com.